Oh yeah, how's it going everybody? It's uh, the Trigger Trey here. This is Reacting to the Internet Part 2. So sit back and relax, enjoy the show. Let's do this. Hi, I'm Mariko Takahashi. Can what you guess who this is? In the history of the yes, internet. it's me. You can't believe it, huh? Thanks. But what I want to say here is hope that anyone could do it. But the so point is, is not person. only to lose weight. That's likely to fail. The important thing is for you to become strong. If you can build the upper body strength, you can lift things much easier. Beautiful arms showing from your summer dress is not a dream. Marzo That's what you want, right? Three days a week or every other day, we'll be building muscular strength. That's what this video is about. Beauty and strength, this is connected to everything in life. Connected to victory and happiness. <laughs> victory and happiness is the most important thing for everyone. Okay, let's go. Pump the arms like you're in the mud. Shoulders down, chest open. Tighten your stomach. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Always slow and strong. Four more coming. Four, read it out. And three, think it up. It's too tighter. Now step aside, outside right here, no arms. With arms. This must be from the golden age of you too. Resistance on the up. Good job, guys. We're doing the strength training now. Let's sit down. We're gonna start from the military press. Hold your hands up in go on point position. Now let's go. It's up. Squeeze in the top and down again. It's up. Squeeze in the top and down again, again. It's up. Squeeze in the top. Deep breath out again. Open your legs. It's up. Squeeze and down again. It's up. Squeeze. Last one. Down. Ready for action. Hold it up. Squeeze it up. Now get it up. Take it up. Squeeze the top and press. Don't touch it down. Don't bag it down. Slow and gently put it up. Come look at this. She's squeezing it down. She's bringing it up and she's bringing it down. Nice control, nice control. And up. Shoulders down. And up. That's it. We're training the thighs now. And up. Press down. Lift it up. Last one. That's it. Face your front. Up, 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 up. Slow and strong. Down. Shh. Up, 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 up. Slow and strong. And down. Thank you for joining. Be well. The fuck was that? Ah, it's a different problem. So it's not. Why are you so surprised? Well, it's not surprising. Minami, it's not surprising. Look, look, look. 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 Why is she got the tennis racket? What the fuck? Yo, why are you touching that man's sack? Oh, <laughs> What the fuck is this? So the man's got dick nipples and he's sitting there playing with another man's nutsack. Okay. 
She's smacking dick nipple milk with a tennis racket. Or whatever that's called. Hey. 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 お受けしてもらう。大丈夫か。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。
なんだこれなんだこれはあこれ印鑑じゃないですかおめえ印鑑じゃねえかよこれなあお前ハンコじゃねえかお前なんだハンコこんなとこ入ってんだよお前なんだそれお前バカかお前こんなとこにハンコ入れて恥ずかしいなお前お前このハンコついちゃうぞいやいやいやいやもうもうもうすいませんなんかあの紙かなんかありましたあいやもういやいやこれでいいですかでいやあすみませんほら Yamato? Yamato? What just cracked my back? Yamato? 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 Oh. I'm so confused as what the hell I'm watching. <laughs> the fuck, <laughs> Discord. Finding water. <laughs> Jaya, oh shit. Water weight. <laughs> Y'all better not say a little like me. Mozzoli, oh sh oh man, that's just horrible. <laughs> Finding Osama, really? Disney and <laughs> Oh hell no, I don't want to see that ever again. I'm not trying to get another YouTube strike. We're gonna find something else to watch. Swedish man dies after trying to what? According to a Swedish newspaper, a man died on Monday after trying to have sex with a hornet's nest. Hold up. He goes by the name. Hold up. Hold up. I I just want to know how horny does one have to be to fuck a hornet's nest? <laughs> Let's watch some more. Pass and was found so swollen that his neighbor thought he was a whale. Well, I guess that's one way to go out with a buzz. <laughs> I shouldn't have made that joke. Now, you're probably wondering how, if his body was unrecognizable, he looked like a whale, did they know he was trying to get with the hornet's nest? Well, they reportedly found semen and pubic hair at the entrance of the nest. <laughs> okay, so was he like doing it as they were stinging him? He just kept going until he died? Like, this dude was just literally hell bent on fucking a hornet's nest. <laughs> Hey, you gotta admit, in all seriousness, this man must have been the most interesting person on the planet for like a brief moment, because imagine just walking in the woods and you just see someone going to town on a fucking hornet's nest getting stung to death. Oh, uh, let's let the play. Gross. According to an expert, Hass must have had some sort of sexual addiction and escalated and pushed the limit. Now, reportedly, yeah. animal rights activists are also mad that he ruined the hornet's nest. <laughs> and well, as a peanuts rights activist, I'm pretty upset too. I mean, look, we all have kinks, but hornets? Now, if all this is sounding a bit fishy, it may very well be a joke. Some Europeans on the metro.co.uk website pointed out that the article was from a Swedish fake news site, but when we looked at it, it seemed pretty legit. Perhaps the real story, though, here is that the media is actually a hornet's nest, and this Swedish website just had its way with us. Yeah, I hope this or is maybe fake. maybe this is all real and based on a very simple... Uh, misunderstanding. I mean, a hornet's nest sure does sound a lot like a horny nest. So who knows? <laughs> anyway, I'm Danny Vega, and this has been a story. See heavy.com for more cool stuff. If this is true, uh, 
I mean, you could have, like, jacked off or cut the ass out of a teddy bear and fucked it, but who the hell wants to fuck a hornet's nest? Some people presume that it is a joke, but we are very serious about penises here. It's a museum where you could take your children. It's terrifying. Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Did this motherfucker say something about you can take your children to go see penises? The fuck? Hello? My name is Thorbjörn Thorsson, and I work at the Icelandic Pathological Museum. The what? We have the world's largest penis collection. Our largest one is. A <laughs> hold up, hold up. It's not just any penis collection. It's the world's largest penis collection. So there's more people to do this shit. I got a question. Uh, let's say if you go on a date with a female. And, you know, y'all get to know each other. Like, how do you explain this to her? Like, yeah, my name is Chad, and I just collect penises. <laughs> uh, let's see what else we got. Uh, average size adult sperm whale, which weighs about oh. 160 pounds. Still oh, why'd y'all weigh it? third of the entire penis. Some people believe it's a way of deconstructing the penis or masculinity. We present the phallus quite tastefully without showing how mating goes for it. We have a few human specimens. I hope these specimens were dead before they started this little dick collection. Like uh, Jimi Hendrix cast. Does size matter? Not with us. We don't discriminate. We have a hamster penis bone, which is our smallest specimen. And we have very good penis-shaped waffles. We... Yeah, I'm not eating that shit. <laughs> Highly appreciate all of our penises. Okay, this is apparently a sperm whale penis. <laughs> okay. I, I I just got a question. Uh somebody seriously woke up one morning and just said, you know what? I think I'm gonna go out to the ocean and collect me a sperm whale penis. <laughs> I'm sure multiple people were involved in this expedition, so that had to been a weird ass conversation. So they went out, found a sperm whale. Hopefully it was fucking dead. It wasn't still alive. Removed it. Somehow preserved it long enough to bring it back to shore. And had a custom made thing. And I'm pretty sure the people who made this de device that they put the penis in were like, the fuck? But uh, yeah, they managed to go through all this trouble just to add a giant sperm whale dick to their fucking collection. <laughs> That's some weird ass fucking people out there. This is enough weird shit. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video. <laughs> Alright, y'all, I saw the trick or treat here. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and end the video. I just can't take no more. Definitely some weird ass shit out there. Uh, I'm gonna put a link to my socials down below if you wanna uh, send me some weird stuff or tag me in some weird stuff. I'll react to it. Uh, yeah, let me know, know in the comments uh, down below what you think. I'm gonna go ahead and peace out, but uh, stay blessed.